welcome to NZ Mortgages Weekly Update. This time it's coming from Ange here at NZ Mortgages. Firstly, I'd love to still be saying up the wires, but unfortunately the um, season ended last weekend, but um, if you're a Warriors supporter and love watching league, then um, I'm sure you'd agree with me that we're super proud as a nation um, of the Warriors and yeah, next year's our year. Heading in from that, what I like to do is just reflect back on my last three months and just kind of see what's been happening, if there are any themes coming through that can be useful for any of you guys out there. We're clearly, we're getting a lot of interest from all around New Zealand, like inquiries from, you know, like Auckland. I've um, been dealing with a client in Australia who recently settled on a property and purchase of a whānau home, a really special moment um, up in Napier. So, I mean, the trends are like, I mean, with technology these days, we don't need to be face-to-face -face a lot of the time. Um, we work with Zoom, um, we work over the phone and a lot of emails. So, you know, if you really want good advice and if you really want the support of our team, we can help you from anywhere. Another theme coming through, um, looking back at the settlements coming up and the settlements, it's been a really busy quarter. A lot of the settlements, as so I look at my clients that are coming through, have actually started as pre-approvals. And the power of the pre-approval is actually quite huge. So it takes a wee bit of time to pull documents together for us to get it to the bank but once we can get you a pre-approval it gives you the confidence to go out there and look and actually make the second part of the process a lot faster. So a pre-approval will last for three months and then generally we can extend that for another three. That's a really good start and it's really good to give you the, um, the confidence of the price range that you're dealing with and potentially if you've got less than 20% deposit you can get yourself in a position to negotiate better and be like a cash buyer if you've got an unconditional offer from the bank. Because once you've got that pre-approval, all we need is a property pack from the real estate agent and then we can send that to the bank and have yeah, pretty much an unconditional approval, which is fantastic. If you've got less than 20% deposit, evaluation is required by the banks. So the power of having a pre-approval in this, this position is actually we've done most of the legwork with the bank, so all we need to do is go ahead and order evaluation, um, which may take up to six days. You know, if we wait until the end, we need to add an urgent fee onto that. So by having that preparation in place, we're gonna save you money at the other end and have you auction ready, if it's an auction you're going to, or have you ready to kind of have less um, confirmation days on your um, on your offer which makes it more attractive to the vendor. Thanks for listening. Yeah, it's great to touch base. Christmas is just around the corner. If you'd like to talk further and you have any inquiries, please reach out on our website nzmortgages.co.nz or give us a call on 0800 100 300.